We've been speaking a lot about how to speak in character, how to get other people to speak in character. Today we're going to focus on a really simple, easy skill that we can do to make everybody feel safe and to give everyone permission to do that together. Hi. Um, GR, this is Player Base, which is a channel about ludology, which is the study of the dynamics of play. And in this series about tabletop role-playing games, particularly how to engage in a very immersive style of playing tabletop role-playing games that isn't intellectual or overly analytical, we're really honing in on how to get people to really feel easily, without any real training, that they can get into a character and they can find a character that really works for them. So today's exercise is about how to make it permissible, how to essentially give people permission to be in character. And it's real simple, and I'm sure you probably have thought of it already, or maybe if you hadn't, you'll be like, oh, why didn't I think of that? And it goes like this. You sit down at the table, and the game master uh, takes an NPC, could be a quest giver, could be a shop merchant, could be uh, like the biggest orc in the party that is ambushing your party. And you give that character a name, you make sure that you know that character's name, and then you go around the table, even on the first day, and you make sure that everybody has a name. And then you go about talking to each other by name. You refer to not Jimmy, but Ragnar, you know, not... Franco, but Lefandrio. Not Louise, but Gamil Zirak. There you go. So it took me a while, but I got it. I couldn't make a fake dwarf name, but I could quote a real one. <laughs> and that's how you do it. It's as simple as that. And you do that for like five or six minutes, just having conversation, just exposition. Nothing too heavy. Talking about, you know, fashion or the price of the apples at the fruit stand, or whatever is right in front of you. Not going into deep backstory, not going into really heavy emotional stuff or high stakes things, just interacting with one another. And it doesn't matter how silly it gets, it's probably going to get very funny, especially if the, if the orc from the uh, ambushing party starts talking to you about fashion, which is perfectly plausible. You just have to, as they say in vaudeville, play it straight. And what that means is, like in an Abbott and Costello or Laurel and Hardy team, there's the comic relief character. So like Dean Martin was the character who played it straight and Jerry Lewis in that comic duo was the one who was the comic relief. And you're all gonna be Dean Martin for this, right? And you're all gonna, no matter how ridiculous the conversation is, you're all gonna play it straight. You're gonna talk to each other, no matter how much you giggle, speaking in first person and also referring to the other person by name, by the character name or in the case of the Game Master, by one or several uh, of the NPC names. It's better because you don't want to be like, oh, what was the name again? You just, just can't one character do the talking for the Game Master. And you do that until basically everyone stops giggling. Uh, and you know, you'll know you find all kinds of interesting things in there that will bring out um, adventure hooks and dynamics of play, all kinds of really interesting things. But you start with just talking to each other in the first person perspective, naming, each character by name, referring to them by name. And you do that until everyone feels comfortable. And they don't, you know, the giggles are coming maybe from something funny that's going on and not just nervous laughter. And that may take 30 seconds, it may take 45 minutes. But in the interim, you'll have something to do that you've never done before in a game. And at the end of it, you'll be so, you'll be wearing the, the character like a, a loose garment. I'm telling you. I can't wait for you to try it and then come back into the comments and tell me how well it worked. I'm GR, this is Player Base. Thanks for watching, and we will see you.